like you meet James E. Hamilton, the most famous of all the barefoot mailmen. The barefoot mailman? Who are they? The barefoot mailmen were the original postal route from West Palm to Miami. These guys walked a round trip of 138 miles. They were the original badasses of Florida. But why is he the most famous? James E. Hamilton actually died in the line of duty right here in Hillsborough Inlet under mysterious circumstances. Let's go find his killer. So it's right here at Hillsborough Inlet where the barefoot mailman met his grisly demise. So how did James die? There are many theories surrounding his death. Maybe he drowned trying to swim to his boat. Maybe it was a saltwater crocodile or a shark. But a lesser known theory, much more mysterious, is that the lighthouse keeper had something to do with it. That's right, the lighthouse keeper. So the barefoot mailmen used to use small boats to transport the mail themselves across all the inlets. These boats were left on the convenient side of the inlet so that when they made their return trip, they could simply hop in that same boat and cross the inlet again. So why would the lighthouse keeper try to do it in the barefoot mailman? Was he a jilted lover, an ex-con? Was he trying to hide his buried treasure? Or was he just lazy? So this is one of the few plaques that marks the historic trail of the barefoot mailman. Boy Scouts of America placed these here in 1966 after retracing his historic 138 mile trip from Palm Beach to Miami. He works six days a week. Oh, he had Sunday off? Sunday. Holy day. Drinking for Jesus. Oh my God. You know, it wasn't actually that lazy lighthouse keeper. Really? Yeah. It was a stranger from the north. Depicted as a wealthy developer in this book that I'm reading. I actually found it on the beach. Barefoot Mailman. Excellent book. I've read it twice. Wealthy developer. Hmm. Sounds, Sounds familiar. familiar. But despite all the greedy developers that have come down here and tried to take advantage of the Sunshine State, the spirit of the Barefoot Mailman is alive and well today. What the fuck?